Nick howdy y'all. My name is Taz Chu. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to SGW Season 3. It's the second episode. And an important announcement. Next Sunday, not this Sunday, but the next Sunday. Not only will we have our first pay-per-view shit in the toilet. But we will also have an announcer. Air Jam sold out and I have no fucking idea where. <laughs> Social media has been buzzing all day with notifications about the big matchups that are set for tonight. I cannot wait for this event. In Detroit, Michigan. I, sure is, I knew that. What's your fucking tell me though? Tonight's contest include Fat Beard vs. Extreme Sumo, our shit turn Continental Champion Brody Bird vs. Juggernaut Jones, Cody Stone vs. Adam Lidke, Chris Danger vs. Aaron Davis, our current reigning defending SGW Champion William Parker vs. Blade Walker, the World Heavyweight Champion Chadwick Thundercock vs. James Edwards, Danny Quinn vs. Eddie Erna, the US Champion Chris Harris vs. Turbo Man, and the main event is a fellow for it between Billy McQueen. Chris Austin, Eric Marston, and Devin Isaacs. So, without further ado, let's get the show underway, shall we? Alright. Introducing the participants first from the Virgin Islands Fat Beard, the Pirate. Hurry up! Alright, let's go. And this is his opponent from Tokyo, Japan. The Extreme Sumo! Get out! Fat Fred draws first blood, got Sumo on the shoulders. Snake eyes. Ooh. Just stepping on him. Oh, Sumo went for something. Sumo went for it again. DDT. I also noticed a, a semi-delay in audio, but I'm like, well, this is shitty gameplay for wrestling. It fits. Chop, punch and a headbutt, and oh, Mr. Mongolian Chop Sumo's just unloading. Don't want to get in a striking contest with a fucking Sumo. Picture perfect drop kick, did hit though. Backbird got him up. The gorilla press. Into a standing moonsault. You fucking get hyped. You earned that. There's a similar to get up. He changed his fucking mind. Standing gorge buster. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. Unloading in Sumo's face. Oh, what a counter! Elbow drop. Oh, more drop. Kick. Here's a cover. A kick out. Not even a one count. A little over eager with that cover. Not the TDT. To 
The dog with another DDT. Fractured might be a little bit too big for someone to get up for his big move. Sumo. Just is the Only a one count, though. proven to be quite the challenge for him here. Going for the Hoya Crab, but trap in reverse. Massive hurricane runner for the big man. BBC Big Brain Catastrophe. Oh, someone barely kicks out. He's got to keep on the offensive. Headed up, he's taking back. Cannonball. Sumo kicks out again. He ain't gonna let a fat man put him on his way like that. Oh, he went for the close line. Still on his feet. The FDT. I don't know how to put DDT. What a shot. One golden shot. In the late stages of the match. Move to something. Side drop in late sleep. Set the puck up, Cole. Someone just beat the fuck out of him. Sumo has a finisher and a signature. We'll slide back in the ring now. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. This will turn your lights up. Exclamation point of two. In the center of the ring, Sumo stares into the heart. Yeah, or he was. He kicked out. We got Hoy Crab. Cracker doesn't get out. Sumo has not only a signature, but two finishers. Big beard catastrophe. Someone kicks out again. Pure instinct. Fat beard. Stanger suplex. Going from cannonball. Cannonball. Is that it for the sumo? No simple kick refuses to stay down. Sumo has two finishers. This could go his way. Sumo playing possum. Exclamation point of doom. Is that all? For fat beer. It is. What a fucking match. Ain't no shame in losing. This match is a banger. What an opening contest, too.
Congratulations to both men. Good open contest. I thought I thought either one of them was like gonna hit the other in the mouth. <laughs> what a way to start off episode two. Next up should be is the Edge Comic Champion Brody Bird taking on Juggernaut Jones. Stay tuned. You don't want to miss this. This next match is a non-title bout set for one fall. And introducing the participant first. He is the SGW Intercontinental Champion. Brody Bird. I think it's ready. <laughs> and here we go. And his opponent. Juggernaut Jones. I just don't know how you. <laughs> Unshakable superstars on the roster. Not his chops, Brody unloading. He's been through Choke bomb. Kick to the leg. Yeah, and stomp. Diving body splash, but it's reversed. High up, up in the corner. In full control here. Face full Crashing his buckle. fucking head into the turnbuckle. Gets him with the Don't know what Brody was going for because it's reversed. Take and punches. Ego Katuki, I think that's what that's called. So. Was it the fireman for a burst? Brody. Blade snap. And a stomp to the arm. Rolling Thunder Flatliner. Really? That counts? Remember fucking last week? Fucking ref was in the. Brody Navi! I remember last week, and that's all. I fucking remember last week of the fucking ref was fucking staring at, I think it was Zumo, fucking staring at Zumo's hand on the rope, and the ref was like, no, but that rope right count? Fuck you. Biased. I'm like a bull crap. I'm glad you're not going to blow your wild wife. Anyway, congratulations to our champion, and uh, next match is underway. Next up, it's Cody Storm versus Adam Lidke. Stay tuned.
Introducing the participants first. Oh yeah, this contest is set for one fall. <laughs> Introducing the participants first. Cody Storm. I'm going under the fucking machine guns. I have to. Drop drop, Cody. <laughs> The fucking time I see that, I can think of his balls. Okay, you guys are fun. And introducing his opponent, representing his band, Fortress United, Adam Lidkey. Let's see, so Adam hasn't been shown yet. He's a call of my friend Adam, who was actually in a band called Fortress United. And you can sense the anger emanating from the competitor tonight. Eyes like a blazing fire. Adam. This is a man you don't want to be in front of right now. Picture He's perfect suplex. Is what he is. Yeah, but he's staring at the Picture perfect DDT. Is that all? No. He expected this challenge and is ready for it. Oh. What a neat a fucking rib cage. Oh god, that hurt. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Uh, uh, yes, yeah, that. <laughs> that's like, is that the throwback? I'm like, no, that's the cutter that John Cena does. Sit out, Gord Buster. I'm going to the top. Diving body splash. Almost, almost. The count went that far. Kick the fucking back. Uh, I don't know what Adam was going for, but Coder reverses with her leg snap. Got to add him in the accordion rack? No, no, that's the, that's the different version of the torture rack. Never mind. I can't remember what that move is called. Honestly, that move should actually have a pin reversal. <laughs> Bang, bang, bang. Some more. I'm gonna cut up the Samoan storm. I was gonna be so sad about him. Did all of that and then just lost. Oh, I don't reversed it. I'm in a cradle. Snake eyes onto the rope. Big elbow drop. Alright, kick it off the kick it off the kick it Oh, he's got a pin. Only oh, yeah, one count, though. What a battle we are witnessing. We're at a stage where someone's going to have to shift it into another gear. Kudo driver. Check connect. Hooking it up. Drum ball. Won his first match. That was the start of the year. Technical difficulties that caused this match to not be seen a whole. This 
This next match is Chris Danger versus Aaron Davis. Stay tuned. And we're back. This contest is set for one fall. From Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. The living legend. Chris Danger. I know. I'm gonna work on my fucking announcer voice. from this superstar tonight, guys. Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility. Damn, that fucking picks are yeah, perfect. He said he's going to make the Two claps and he's caught in. Then I've done that. Just for the DDT. And we won the DDT. Picture perfect mental, too. Is that all? Referee in position. Two. Yeah. A solid early two count. This could be over sooner than we thought. Good defense. Oh, look at this wicked striking ability. Like he's got the arms and feet. The. Do you know what that fucking move that is called? Blackout? Back, clutching the wrist. This absolutely punishing their opponent. This one that snap, no, this is the one that the knee drop. Knee to the fucking the knee. Hamstring crushing knee strikes. Repeated strikes. These consecutive attacks have him really. He's on his heels. He went. Sure. Go ahead. Take the fucking knee. Take the goddamn knee. Ooh. Gonna do something, Davis? You fucking whipped it. To the back. Here it comes. Lights out if this connects. Damn, special. Bicycle. Oh, you want to switch him? He's a reverse. Spinning the room, Nucky. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Sky high. Davis bomb. Chris is put away. Quite a lot closer, man. Especially since these two are such high caliber people. But nonetheless, congratulations to Aaron Davis. An important victory for him in this match. A win like that proved he is not messing around. That match was all business from him, Corey. And that worked. Punch. Take a guess what the next match is. It's William Parker, our SGW champion, versus Blade Walker, who won a very first main event of the season last week. Stay tuned. This next bout is set for one fall. It is a non title match. This is going to be good. In introducing the first, he is the S. 
IGW World Champion William Parker Next <laughs> Introducing his opponent, Blade Walker. Very, very, very promising career. Very promising career for Blade Walker. And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overlooked recently. Well, double arm DDT. Double arm DDT. Well, he'll be someone who has been looking for a challenge. A straight jacket DDT. God damn. <laughs> double arm underhook and double arm by the executive fucking thing. Playing his fucking knee in his goddamn face. Played with a half and half suplex. Well, he's got the. Big man was powerful. Taking this match off the mat now. Play up top. On the top. Oh, 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 the elbow oh, drop. Oh, I didn't know that. I mean, he's trying to get caught into the fucking game. I forgot that that's fucking cool. Wonky, but cool. Tearing the body apart. He moves just in time. Blade. Oh, no. Parker with a spinning sidewalk slam. See over here. Fine into the man. We'll get your attention. Makes him pay with a counter. Hey, this kick is chopping and punching. The damage he's taking is starting to punch the side. He'll be in a good position. Able to avoid any harm there. Parker. Sign me out of the side of the slam. I mean, come on, it's a good Second best. Can't quite get him there. DDT. Martin Stacker into his feet. What impact off that knee lift. And then he knee lift and threat and poison the Rana. Is that all for the champion? Just a no. Do it to Tower Bomb. Is that all for the underdog? After the match, no. I thought for sure that was it. I do not. Oh, is this thing here? Suplex. For all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Nasty right hand. Martin Zagiri. Crashing to the floor. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. That kick will stop me in your tracks. It's he not. off. Was coming. Both superstars showing great awareness of their own repertoire. We've got a oh, powerbomb position. This plan here can't be good. Oh, apron power bomb and just whips him into a fucking big apron as well. He turns it around. so close to fucking face off the apron. 
Hart back in the ring. He is truly feeling it right now. As well he should. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Tossed into the steel steps. Hammerlock. Uh oh, uh oh. The arm getting pummeled. A sacrifice. Shades of Pentagon. No Penta Zero? Whichever one it is. Oh god, oh god. Time! God, not the apron, but the outside. I looked at the fucking apron mid sentence and my brain went, Apron! Both wrists captured. Kami Koye! Oh, they want to brawl on the outside still. Neck breaker, final cut combo. Just get back into the ring for the love of God. Thank you. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Why? Okay, he <laughs> played just blade. Blade to blade it before he even got hit with the DDT. That's what the fucking red blink was. I'm like, what? It's like you didn't even get hit with a move yet. Oh, pop up with a gut wrench. For the love of God, this is. This is a boss man work. Leg drop to the fucking left arm. Please get it back in the ring. Please. And stay in there. What are you doing? Get in there. Oh, you're about to get counted out. Thank you. Oh, 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 out. Parker stays in it. Bang! drops over and over and over to the left. Oh, he kicked out. I didn't think scout. Still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure. Shotgun. What a matchup. Our champ remains undefeated. I think. I'm going to take notes. <laughs> Here's another look at some of the previous action giving their fans their money's worth. Fucking congratulations to the champ. What a matchup. Exactly. Exactly. Next matchup is Chadwick Thundercock. Our world heavyweight champion versus the best bout machine of SGW, James Edwards. Stay tuned. This next bout is set for one fall as a non title match. Introducing the participants first from the nearest nightclub, weighing in at 500 pounds of fuck me. He is the reigning. SGW World Heavyweight Champion Chadwick 
Thundercock. And in introducing his opponents. From Kyoto, Japan. It's the best bout machine of SGW. James Edwards. For the love of God, James, please don't fuck this up. Play. And here we have a superstar who's been grinding his teeth at the performance center as of late. Yeah, a consistent work ethic is what you're talking about, Michael. He's not someone who will rest on his laurel. Bill Talk. Bill. File. Bill. Bill. Talk. I go. A man who has been counting the minutes. Wow, I fucking hate that animation so bad. There's no way to reverse it. There's no. Well, Here's the early there's like no. Is that it already? No, there's no to get this over with reversal for it. Not even like a, a uh, rope. Precarious position for both superstars. Oh gosh. Right, so it's like, there's no major reversal. From a seated position, suplex on the outside. Adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Boom, what an STO. Nicely done. Whoa. Oh, it went for a single arm suplex. Vicious combination of strikes. Blackout. Backdrop suplex almost onto the step. Oh, impressive counter. Do we not have a repeat of what happened last match, please? Oh man, you can see he is feeling it now. Six. Jack coming back into the ring. Chadwick got him up. Power slam. He thinks he has it. Is that all? He's able to kick it before two. Channeling is But James does have a signature now. What a fucking nice. Bottom rope moves up, didn't connect though. Inverted suplex. Insane elbow. Is it enough? Is it enough? No. The end was in sight. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Firm control. Oh, what a Moonsault. And shoulders are down. Not He's barely a one count. Or get the better of him. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Got it scouted. Reversal. It's in the arm. Oh, yeah. What a close line. Beautiful suplex. What the fuck was that? Uh -oh, <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was, but there was no sound. Power bomb. I've never Got seen that animation before. A truly impressive kick out this late. Ben Bradley. 
Jamangiri. Let's say another one's up, but right now, the last one was a, oh, oh, got him up, Dream Street. James Edwards beats the champion. Jesus Christ, his chat was 0-2. The fact that when I play this game normally, the, the Chad was a better champion than he is. Fuck, <laughs> he's getting the Rey Mysterio treatment. Fuck Chadwick. Here's the one, Chad. But the next matchup is Danny Quinn, the Dragon Slayer, versus the Sinner, Eddie Erna. Stay tuned. This next bout is set for one fall. In introducing the participant first. I probably should have started. We'll see this later. In first. The Dragon Slayer. Danny Cohen. We start doing that a little bit later. Or maybe talk a little bit more and then get to the dragon player. And introduce his opponent. From Blackpool, England. The center, Eddie Erna. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE. About to take part in one of the most anticipated oh, yeah. matches. Yeah, that. Okay. Let's get this match underway, shall we? What are you expecting from this superstar tonight, guys? Well, he Punch. did say earlier that he's going to attack. <laughs> 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 Not even standing. a one count. Fuck out, Danny. What a did Danny do to Eddie? He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Summer salt drop kick. Producing a thing to do. This is gonna work. Corey. No way. Oh, yes, way. So close to deliver. He's looking a little off balance. He planned for this and could still rally. What an overhead chop. He just chopping the fuck out of Danny. Damn, belly to belly. Oh my god. Moonsault. Trying to pull the arm around the socket. Shoulder hostage now. Yes. 
in finding any space to recover. Yeah, every attempt to fight back is being negated. Yeah, he's able to stop the bleeding, but will he also gain command? Belly to belly. Belly to belly. Vicious. Stick kick. U.S. Champion Chris Harris versus Turbo Man. Stay tuned. It is now time for the main event of the evening. It is a fatal four match set for one fall. In the first, from Helena, Montana, the OG Austin. Chris Austin. And introducing his opponents first. From the internet. The NFT came to life. Billy McWee. And who's next? From San Antonio, Texas. The Cowboy, Eric Morstan. Introducing their opponent. Hurry up! Devin. Wha Devin Isaacs. Devin from Texas. Houston, Texas, I'm assuming. I'm gonna try by the fucking pay per view to get everybody's names, their weight. For his names, weight, and hometown on notes. And here we go in this no disqualification match. match. Nothing is off limits here. Up. This is the perfect setting for the superstar to fight without any regard for the rule book. Uh, and more quickly, Chris with the uh, hammerlock scoop plan. Kevin McWeeb with landslide. Just take out the fucking knee. Take out the very busy of the knees. Fucking cheese. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Quickly slipped behind. Fucking A. Bill almost got a suplex on his goddamn face. Speaking of suplex, oh, oh broken arrow. Never mind. And Corey not to put your hand on bar. Devin's out. Military press slam, Billy fucking taunting. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Vibrations. Okay, Eric. 
Bad throws, what the fuck ever. Eric and Billy are no, Eric and Chris are out of the ring. Chris and Billy going after each other. Eric or Billy. Crash, I don't know who the fuck you want. Reversal. Reversal. Why the dogs work out? No bad idea. Yeah, Can't shoot flex. Flex laugh. Another ring. Well, I got for out of the ring. No. Because I'll just put Eric away. Gets the show. Oh, man. really thought that was it. He's now tracking the opposition. And set him up. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Fucking hell. Comes back into the ring. From behind. Oh, German shoot. What is that? He's in a little bit of trouble now. This match certainly has taken its time. Grace has a finisher. Clearly has his signature. And Eric has a signature. This is terrible. Saving grace. Dead on. Down. Wind him up. Quick throw. He's taking a huge boost right now from all those chances. Where are you going? He's heading back to the ring. Getting back into the ring. Placing them into the corner. Here it comes. Death Bell Presser. Can he shut the door on this one? Oh, he almost got it. I thought that was fucking it. I thought that was that goddamn smart. This fire right now. He's a projectile now. Isaac is out. Eric's out too, but he rolled out on the cord. And the has a signature and truth in his position. All in. Shades of the heartbreak kid. Covers Cross. Billy kicks out. Just an incredible wherewithal to get the shot up. Now you would think he'd be out of it after taking that maneuver. All that work, all these big moves. And Last one. Bobby's not here. Come on. Waiting for the death by Chris or Billy reverses. And this place is jumping. Billy has 30 finishes and a fucking finisher. He's traveling up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Oh, he went for a diving double action like this. 
Physics trying to make Devin tap out on the fucking outside. Congratulations to Billy McWeave as a five star match. And that was the main event. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next week. And we're back. I paused the video this time. The game is. Oh, the god that failed. So, the wife call. Priorities. <laughs> yeah, I know we did. Oh, well, he went and made, like, oh, he's trying to be like, uh, Ed from. So, uh, what the fuck is his name from the Try Guys? Nope. High fly flow. Almost. Why I'm chewing on ice? It's because my throat is already getting it scratchy. <laughs> so that's a mission. Fucking should be. <laughs> but um, you can probably hear my voice. I'm getting my voice again scratchy. <laughs> Trying to reduce the irritation. What a scary. Position to be in right now. Is that all? No. Arm breaker. Until Fujiwara armbar. That should honestly get into a submission. 